Hello people, so today's tutorial is going to be about creating a database and also creating a table inside our new database. So let us start with going to our IDE. We have a .env in our project. Copy and paste the .env file in the same folder and rename it as .env.local. So draw env and local renamed the same file as dot local. So do the following additions: database underscore URL beside this line. We need to create our new database. So my database name is Finster. And the local host I'm giving is this, and the root name is root. So we need to hit the command to actually create the database with our new name. So let's hit in the command prompt php in console function database colon. Or uh, you can also type PHP bin console ddsc. So create a database fenster. Now let's add a table inside a new database. Right. So fenster was created. Now let's add a table. So hit the command PHP bin console make entity. So this is a class and we need to create different um, different fields and values inside the class. So let's say we are taking the class name as Africa. So two files have already been created, which is Africa.php repository. And let's have a look at it. So in the repository folder, I have this. And in the source folder, we will have, sorry, entity folder, we have africa.php. Now I want to write the properties name, say Africa has different countries. So let's say countries, the property name, string of course, 255. Uh, yes. Now avenue properties, capitals, string, yes. Five, yes, updated and population string. Oh, sorry, population is an integer value. Yes, control C, stop adding any properties and. Now do the make migrations, so you want to see your created properties inside your database. So you want to see your table and properties. So php in console created a schema, so I'm going to use make migration. Success. Now we want to 
see our version. Go to Finsta. You have a version, but you don't have an Africa class, uh, yeah, Africa table. So I want to create an Africa table. So PHP in console doctrine. Migrate migration. Migration. Migrate. Oh also you can write it down PHP bin console DMM. Yes. So the table Africa already exists. Now we want to update it because it exists, yes, but with the new properties. So let's update it. PHP bin console. Doctrine schema update. Yes. Now if we can go here and we check the Finster. Africa is created. And then Created. Now let's remove this table, which is Africa. Drop this and then create an update. So now if you go to the Africa, you will see the three fields IDs, countries, capitals, population. So that's how we update. Before I had ID and countries, but I removed that and created a new Africa entity. Now, um, database already had the ID and countries entity and that's why it was giving a duplication error. Now as I've used the command which is an update command that is php bin console doctrine update uh, schema update and then it updated my schema with a new and then create and then hit uh, the doctrine migrations command then it has changed from just the before properties to um, to the newly created properties so it actually updated my schema so um, so thank you for watching uh, if you like the video please like share and subscribe bye